What is up, everybody? Tubaverse TV today. So we got to talk about this story where Sony is telling they're giving a cease and desist for the company D Brand, who makes the PS5 plates. Apparently, they make a black plate for the PS5, so the sides of being white, it's all black. I don't know if people like that. They want to customize the PS5. And Sony told them, guys, to cease and desist. Stop selling this stuff. We don't want you selling it at all. And I'm like, really? Is this really a big deal that Sony has to like have a cease and desist for? It's kind of ridiculous. If a third party company wants to make products for, I guess, the PS5, I guess it's a big deal. And I know companies like, um, I know a lot of companies make third party stuff for Nintendo. I've never seen Nintendo going after them, but I don't know. Maybe this is a, a thing Sony's in a right for. Who knows? But we know Jim Ryan. <laughs> We know these Sony guys aren't buying up exclusives because he says, hey, these Sony games need to be selling 100 million, so like 20 million. He wants to see like those Nintendo exclusive type numbers, and he doesn't have with the PlayStation base right now. So they're trying to go for whatever money they can, and they want these guys to stop, I guess, taking out their pocket or taking out their hands when they take it out their, um, they want them to stop making money on what they're making. So I guess that's the deal here. But here's an actual article that talks about it. Um, D brand pulls his PS5 dark place from sale after Sony threatens legal action. Jeez. Earlier this year, D brand started selling matte black PS5 side plates that it called that it called dark plates. And when it did, it made a Sony right on the price page and for ghost us. <laughs> so they was talking kind of spicy too. I mean, I mean, you kind of edged it on. Maybe they knew Sony was gonna be like super money hungry, try to sue them. So they was kind of maybe, trying to, maybe that's why they tried to bait them out. But that's still, I wouldn't, I wouldn't. Uh, poke the bear as to say in this situation then they say as of Saturday though you can't buy dark place anymore as D brand has removed them from sale receiving a cease and desist letter from Sony uh, yeah uh, so it says they got a cease and desist and they can't sell them anymore I guess they're gonna get sued yep so if you wanted to get these plates you gotta go you gotta go to another big third party company you can't get it from D place anymore because they stop selling them so that is interesting and some people have to say about that Sony <laughs> is this expression right there. Damn, so I have a limited edition PS5 now. I guess for all the, the black one. Let me see. Okay, so this is what all black one looks like with the plates on it. I mean, it looks. I mean, I guess I don't, I'm not really feeling it, but I guess people like it. I right, see. Remember when they were threatening Sony to sue them, taunting Sony to sue them. Yeah, so they were kind of edging and all like tying them. I mean, I mean, you kind of poking the bear at that point. Like, I don't know. Lawsuit from Sony just arrived. <laughs> Happy I got mad in the first wave. I mean, it looks pretty cool. I mean, it looks pretty cool like that. Um, it's all in funny games until you get thrown with a lawsuit. Yeah, it's like once you get that lawsuit paper, you wanna, you might wanna calm down at that point. Uh, the brand does not appear to be a grant to comply with a permanent cease and desist, though. It says it will comply for now. Man, I fell in love with this company more and more. Yeah, they're trying to find, like, some legal... Di so I'm, I'm pretty, pretty sure trying to find some legal workaround so they don't get sued. I'm pretty sure they're trying to, still trying to sell these things but not get sued for it. Um, so I'm pretty sure they got lawyers trying to talk about this, the legal situation, the legal, the legal jargon about this situation out, so... Um... Then Sony needs to freaking make some first party plates. Yeah, it's kind of like if, since you aren't making a product, other people can go to somebody else for the product. So I kind of see why D Brand has done it because Sony hasn't done it. So I mean, I don't know. The cost of procrastination, face palm. This is a very strange move. Given how long it took them, I thought that since the sale was going on for a few months, no one would do that. Especially that D Brand first marketed the plates and only after a couple of weeks started selling them. I can't even get a PS5. <laughs> Restricted Sony could allow this being sold for a portion of each product so Yeah, or they could work with D brand. I don't say they just want to do like a higher D brand like a portion of it at least. I mean, I don't know. I said already told me cease and desist. I don't know. Not gonna lie, I'm impressed they held the line this long. <laughs> Wait, I just ordered my S yesterday. <laughs> I'm assuming they still gotta fulfill it, but I don't know. That's crazy. You just ordered yesterday and this news come out. Uh, oh well, they were daring something to do something about it. Be careful what you wish for. Uh, yo, Sony, what the F? D brand is boss. Go ahead, sue us. Yeah, I don't agree. With, I don't agree with them tying something like that. Uh, I don't agree with that. He's like, he says, Rube just made the cut. 
That's unfortunate. I don't like how they won't let anyone make side panels for the PS5. Yeah, so I, I agree that Sony should make them themselves. They don't want other people making it. Like, if they're not going to make it, then why do they have a problem with someone else making it? Um, this really sucks, but the silver line is when we get to read D Brand calling Sony terrorists, which made me do a short snot, a short, a loud snort. Okay. Hope Sony starts selling plates. <laughs> I'm assuming they're gonna start selling plates because a lot of studio company that's making them, that's making them as well. And yet they're a dime a dozen on Amazon. What the f? Not so cocky now, are they? Uh, let's see. The, let's look at some of the quote tweets because this is an interesting situation right here. <laughs> look at PlayStation being assholes per usual. Wow, how stupid. Sony being S as per usual. Lucky I already got mine. F you very much, Herman Host. <laughs> this dude said F Herman Host personally. Like, geez, how do you know Herman Host is behind any of this stuff? And whoever played a part in this, remember when they asked Sony to sue them? I just don't agree with that part. Like, you kind of, Ed, you kind of like taunting them and like poking a bit. I just don't agree with that part about it, but I think they're just being like, um, I don't I just don't agree with that part about it. Uh, let's see. Sony giving D brand a sun size marketing spotlight here. Also F all Sony. <laughs> Cringe move Sony. LMAO, they dare PlayStation and PlayStation shoot and PlayStation sued them anyway. It took Sony long enough. Glad I got this while I could. Uh glad I already got my dark plates. I defended Sony before, but they have localization and everything in my country. But I'd rather use a gray area method to have Game Pass and support something like this. Xbox is friendly. Well, PlayStation and Nintendo should eat us for suing everyone for BS reasons. Okay. Then make them yourselves and supply them. I kind of agree with that statement. They don't want other people selling their product that works for their system. Then they should make it themselves. Like, they should just do that flat out. Like, if you have a problem with D brand making these plates and then make it yourselves, then at this point. Allows third-party companies to sell charges and controls on Amazon. Freaks out over a place that can be used on a console they have to buy from you in the first place. F Sony. Wow. People are not liking this move from Sony right here. Sheesh, I'm glad I already got my plates. Um, this is sort of crazy. They were literally publicly, publicly taunting Sony to sue them when they started selling the plates. As if they knew Sony couldn't touch them. Yeah. What is wrong with Sony? Crying emoji. Sony and their BS. Rest in plates. Okay. Admittedly, they have this coming by, by literally saying, go ahead and sue us. And once again, I got to say, I just don't agree with them taunting Sony like that. Like, you're kind of asking for it to put your taunting. If you're taunting Sony to come sue you, they're going to sue you like they just did. So, And he says, still got to admire Sony dedication to keeping the PS5 looking as ugly as possible. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they're gonna have a custom PS5 edition soon. The, the biggest solution comes out, they probably have a custom PS5. Well, Sony, I'm gonna need y'all to announce your own place because you're dragging your feet, to be honest. Because you're dragging your feet, to be honest, okay? Sony designed a PlayStation with customizable plates, yet in a year has totally failed to offer a single official product. Sony could be selling products, Sony could be licensing third party products, but no, Sony put all their effort into blocking other companies instead. Yeah, don't make any sense to me. Beautiful, but the PS5 is too effing big. This is so stupid, especially since there's no official alternative at the moment, despite the hunger for official black plates. Yeah, a lot of people don't like the black and white color. They want to have either white, pure white, or having pure black. They don't like the whole mixture of both. Makes me wonder the timing of this means Sony is about to launch their own black plates now since they left D brand alone for a bit. And because Sony released all black controllers, like why release the all black controller if you're not going to release like, some black plates with it? I mean, I never. I was assuming I was assuming it was gonna make it like an all black place. They was gonna start selling all black place when they released the controller, but they just never did that. So, uh, dear PlayStation, stop doing this unless you're gonna release some of your own, and they better be affordable. If slash when you do release some, so I'm gonna conclude it right here. It seems like that's a sentiment. It's like people want some to actually re to actually release their own if they're gonna sue this company, and it just it's just kind of ridiculous at this point. Like really. <laughs> 
<laughs> but then again, I kind of got to go with Sony because you yeah, have a company that's kind of you telling you to go ahead and sue us. Then if Sony sues you, you kind of got to expect it to come because you're taunting them like you're poking the bear once again. So I don't blame Sony on in that last part. If they weren't, if they wasn't taunting Sony, then I'd be like, y'all are some a-holes for suing them. But since they taunted Sony, it's like they kind of deserved it. So I don't know. Definitely see your thoughts about this whole situation. Leave a like, like this video, and as always, thanks for watching, and peace.